Hello, it's Jack here, and welcome back to another behind the scenes video. And uh, yes, this is it. This is my behind the scenes video that I've been waiting for for quite a while on face. And uh, yes, today is another face one. And uh, today we're going to be showing off finally my new iPhone XX Max. I know it's a bit a bit a bit difficult how to say. I'd say the um the um the word of it, but. Yes, today is the video of showing it off completely. I did do two clip videos of it. I know that they're on YouTube at the moment. But today, it's going to be the full behind-the-scenes video of showing it off. So I'm going to be showing you everything that works on it. And I'm also going to be um, showing you guys um, all the apps that I've got on it and stuff like that. Um, and yeah, so behind-the-scenes video is kind of like a thing where I just talk about stuff. And uh, basically, um, um, basically, the way how it works um, of, of behind the scenes, basically I do stuff on faces and I do stuff on uh, on gameplay videos as uh, as well. But but basically this was uh, this was, uh, was a behind the scenes video I was really looking forward to, and today we're going to do a full video of showing off my new iPhone X Max. Okay, let's get into it then. So uh, here we go. So uh, this is the uh, the phone here. So this is the uh, the front of the screen here. So you can see that it does look a bit different than my uh, iPhone Seven. Because I realised that when I got my iPhone 7, I didn't I didn't even do a behind the scenes on it. I didn't even do a behind the scenes video of showing it off. I know you guys have probably have probably seen it in, in a few videos, but uh, basically I, I didn't do like a full behind the scenes on that one. But at least I'm doing one on this one now, which is which is good. But um as the so I've only had this phone for uh, just over a week now. Uh, and basically I've um, it's been doing very, very well. Uh, since I got it I got it fixed, it's uh, been doing very, very well. It's not been very, very laggy. I've been really enjoying using it. And uh, I think it's a great phone. Um, the reason why I went for the uh, iPhone X uh, X Max uh, because I know I know that there's another version like this called the S. Um, I think that one's a little bit more smaller than the X version. I think I, uh, I believe I, I'm not sure whether it is on or it's the same one. I don't know, but yeah, I went for the the X Max version. X. I know there's actually an S version as well. So, um, uh, so yeah. So basically, I I got the um, yeah the phone. Uh, it does feel a, a, a lot bit different compared to the other one. Uh, the most um, uh, most difference is it doesn't have a touch button. But basically, the way how you how you open it up is you have to press the big button on the side, and then technically it um it um it opens up from it from there. So, so basically, how's the phone been so far? I think it's been um, I think it's been pretty pretty good so far. Um, I've only used it for a week. I took it to college every every week and all that kind of thing and because I've actually finished college for a week now, so I can start using it a lot bit more now. Um. And I think to be honest with you, it don't it don't feel too bad to be fair. Um, the dropping situation has not happened at the moment. I've not dropped it since, so uh, that's uh, that's good. Um, and uh, I'm I'm just pretty much loving it to be fair. Especially I do love the the case of it though. Like the case is pretty pretty good as well. I like technical. Just love like seeing the the case of the phone, and I think the case is just really really good to be able to to use. Also, uh, it's got a big camera button as well, so it's got um, a big camera to to take photos and videos and all that kind of thing as well. Um, and yeah, I I just I just love it completely so far. I think it's just uh, a really really good phone. And uh, because the reason why we went for the um the um X10 Max is because that. Uh, my phone I was supposed to be getting was the iPhone 8 Plus. I was supposed to be getting that one, uh, but apparently um, my um, my mum wanted me to go on the new one because uh, apparently um, she thought that the iPhone 8 was a bit old. So uh, I went on the uh, iPhone 10X Max, um, and I, I, I didn't really mind what, which one I wanted. I, well, technically I wanted this one anyway. So I uh, I went on that one. We um, we got it all sorted. We um, I got it from my from my local uh, shop where Crystal Peaks is. I got it from over there, um, and uh, yeah, that's where I actually got it from. Uh, the bad on price situation was pretty much okay from selling my uh, my old one uh, because I actually uh, sold my uh, my old one uh, because I did actually have my old one, but I had to sell it away. But the good news is, by the way, is I had to get all my apps back on again uh, compared from the old one, and it it was actually too difficult. I did spend um, I think about two hours. Uh, of getting all my apps back on, and um, it didn't even take me that long at all. So um, that was that was really really good. Because uh, that's what um what I hate about like getting uh getting new phones and stuff like that because you have to put like new apps on, and it's just really really annoying. But at least uh, I can I can I can basically get it on. So I will be moving the the webcam in a minute. I'm just uh, standing up for now because basically uh, it, it it's just not going to be me like this. I'm going to be uh, putting my my webcam uh, down here, and I'm going to be uh, showing you guys what's going to be on the phone compared to the um. If you did see that that clip video I did um a really long time ago, a bit curious showing the the uh, the old phone off, so I'm going to do exactly the same in this one. But this one is just a full 
uh, behind the scenes of the video. And I think to be honest with you, the feeling of, uh, of it is uh, is pretty good. Uh, also, uh, when you when you get into the phone, it's pretty pretty easy as well. Um, and uh, yeah, I think it's just uh, pretty pretty good. I do put it in my pocket as well, like every every morning if I'm going out, I, I usually zip it up so I don't drop it. The good news is, by the way, is I've not dropped it yet, so I, I don't want to say that yet. I did do um, a bit of an experiment video in that first clip video I uploaded, and basically that's another bit that I that I'd be able to uh, to drop. And I think to be honest with you, I do I do love the phone so far. Uh, I think it's um, a really really good one. Also, another thing I do love about the other phone is basically it's got a lot more gig on it now. So basically, I noticed uh, that when I when I logged into it for the first time, I noticed that uh, that I've got a uh, lot lots and lots of storage now. Uh, because I think that I have explained is I won't be um, I basically won't be uh, filming on my phone all the time. Uh, because there is a couple of reasons why it's because that my storage might end up going down straight away and um yeah i'm not going to be using it all the time for filming i will start doing uh, doing vlogs on it uh, but that won't be every time now because i did say from before that i will be cutting down on vlogs but basically i won't be doing a vlog every uh, every wednesday because why well, i don't go out as many places now so um but yeah they, st they still will be vlogs but i just won't be doing them every time so that's going to be um going to be another thing. I did uh, also download iMovie as well. So iMovie is like it's back. I managed to get that back on as well. So I'll be able to do uh, these these little animation videos. I'm going to start doing. It, uh, I've I've started doing. Um yeah, I did all them them little animation videos I'm doing on iMovie at the moment. I think the last one I posted was uh, was a collaboration with Mark, with Nathan. I think I think I think that was the last one that I did. So I'm going to try and do more of those. Um and also there uh, there will be uh, more um vlogs coming up as well. So. I think that's everything that we need to talk about. And also, my contract is on O2 now, so it's not an, it's not on EE anymore. It's on O2 now. So, yeah, so I think, I, I, I think that's an, uh, basically enough to say about the phone now. So now, uh, uh, I'm going to do the behind the scenes. I'm basically showing it off now. So if I just can put it down here. I believe my webcam should be hopefully big enough. If I just go... Uh, aha! Yes, it is. It's fine. So, um, yeah, so here we go. So here we go. So this is the upper phone here. So this is the upper front. This is the back. This is the side. And this is the side. So right then, let's uh, let's get into it then. So let's go and get into the phone itself. So I'm just going to go and log into it, and, and then yeah, I'll, I'll come back. So I'm just going to go and put that down here. And just get myself uh, logged in. There we go. There we go. Easy, easy peasy. And uh, here we go. So you can see that this is the at the front of it here. So you can see I've got um, quite a few apps all together. So you can see I've got uh, my home app. I've got all my uh, all my social medias there. So you can see see them all. Facebook, Messenger, Instagram, uh, all, uh, basically all of my kind of social medias, and uh, and oh yeah, um, I've actually got Snapchat now. So if you guys want to uh, want to follow me on there, I will go and put my uh, my Snapchat account in the um in the description below. And also this is the other one, so you can see I've got YouTube Studio. Uh, oh, you can't even really see it. Um, there we go. So you can see I've got a uh, YouTube Studio. I've got the I've got YT Gaming, which is YouTube Gaming. I've got Skype, Speed Test. I've also downloaded like all these news kind of things because because basically uh, I know that all of you do know that, uh, that I am a motorbike person so I like to uh, download all the um all the apps for like motorbiking or something like that so I've downloaded all those you can see that I've got Google uh, Chrome Google Home uh, Google Photos as well so I'll be able to uh, to get some really good photos uh, there's iMovie as well so I'll be able to uh, use that for it for vlogs and like little clip videos and something like that and I've also downloaded this app called Intros which I will do my own intros at some point I don't want that is what it's going to be yet. And then basically down here, um, it's, it's just the same as the old one. Uh, we've got the other phone, we've got Safari, we've got Messengers, and we've got we've got the uh, the music app. So um, I'm not gonna um, I'm not gonna click uh, on them all because I know that a lot of it's kind of a privacy. So um, so I will go and show you the uh, the messages now. Uh, I did uh, get some from it from O2. Uh, I think it should be somewhere. Yeah, here we go. So I got one. Uh, oh, not that one. Uh, I got one from. Uh, keep, I keep pressing the wrong one. Uh, um, yeah, here we go. So you can see I've got I've got that one there, and I've also got uh, well, keep pressing the wrong button here, and uh, and one on one there as well. Because uh, probably another thing is as well is basically uh, EE did uh, did did send us a message as well, uh, telling us about that I did that I did move, and also you can see I've got all my messages from my from my friends there. So I'm not going to really uh, basically open up all the pages uh, like all the uh, social media just because I I don't really I don't really film them. Also I've got the settings. I'm going to go show you some in the settings as well. Uh, I'm just going to go and show you my gig situation. So I'm going to show you that. So, uh, um, is, it in, is it in here? Here we go. So you can see, uh, um, uh, if we go to, to Applicize, I'm not sure if you can see it on the uh, on the camera, but basically it says 64 gig. Uh, is, my, is my camera working? Okay, my camera's a bit faded. 
Um, aha, there we go. So you can see on the screen there, it says 64 gig. And basically, correct, I've got 64 gig on my capsules. So that is actually the, the maximum gig I, I've got. So basically, I was actually wrong on the old one. Uh, cause, uh, because basically, my gig uh, was supposed to be at 270. Uh, but apparently that was way too much, so I uh, I got on 64. But apart from that though, my storage is not going down as too much this time because I I've got four point or I got 46.1 left, which is which is going to be a lot because I said from before uh, that I'm not going to do a lot of a lot of videos uh, using it. And you can see um another thing I had to do is uh, um, is as well is I had to download all my songs back. So basically all the songs that I had that I kind of listened to, I had to download all them back as well. And another good thing is by the way is basically um. Another thing that I have done as well is I have started to delete the videos on the camera. Um, the reason why I, I, I decided to do that is because that basically uh, one problem is uh, is because that like basically that takes some of the storage up. So this is my, my name here. So it says um, uh, Jack's iPhone 10 X Max. So you can see on the on the screen there. So and that's kind of the, the way how it works. So that's kind of technically all the settings. Uh, also I will get updates um, as well, automatic updates as well. And, uh, and if we go down to it to iPhone storage, uh, you can see that this is where all my um all my stuff is going to it to be. So if I just go and show you like that, so you can see that I've got all my apps down there as well. So um that's that's fine. So you can see I've got seventeen point eight gig at the moment, uh, but I will be getting um a, a little bit more of it in the future. Uh, also, I'm going to show you in, uh, in camera. So basically, the camera view is not too bad. So I'm going to show you uh, a full review of my um of my camera. So that is actually what my camera is going to be. So you can see that the camera uh, 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 face does look a lot more better, uh, basically than my previous phone. Because uh, another thing I've noticed as well that my camera is in is in one K. You can kind of see the one K button down there. You can actually see it's in one K view. So if I go like completely, if I go like show you around a little bit of it, you can see you can actually see that the view is actually incredible. And if we go to it to video as well, like video will be exactly the same because the video is in one K as well. So if we just go and show you around here, you can see that the focus on it uh, does look a lot bit more better uh, compared to the old phone, uh, because like basically from the um, from the old phone, um, it just it, it basically just wasn't um, very very good for the old phone, just because of my uh, my camera uh, length wasn't really good. Uh, but I technically noticed that my, that my camera does feel a lot more better on um, on on this one. So exactly the same on camera. Uh, you get you get portrait camera. You get squared camera like this is a uh, one thing I don't even use like for some reason I don't, I don't even use like the uh, the other options for ca uh, for camera. Uh, another thing I really use is only video and photo just because like, I don't really use the other ones because the problem about the other ones is that is they're just not very very good. So yeah, I, I, I don't I don't really like them ones. And you can't see I've got all my all my apps that I need. So I've got the news. So I could just go and check the news and stuff. I got the clock. Uh, basically, the clock is why I can set my alarm. Uh, basically, every like college morning or every like late night or something like that. Um, because basically the other day I forgot to set my alarm uh, on my on my phone. That it, it's, it's the first time I forgot to do it uh, because I uh, I fell asleep the other night and I forgot to um yeah I actually forgot to uh, to set my alarm. So I need to hopefully remember to set my phone on it on every single phone. But yeah yeah basically it's just exactly the same as the old phone. It's got all the apps that you need. And then it's got them ones, them ones, and them ones. I haven't got many because um another thing that I'm not going to be doing is I'm not going to be uh, doing any games on it. And the reason why is because that the games do take a lot of storage up, and I'm not going to bother uh, just getting uh, any games because I want to because my phone is actually part of a uh, YouTube, so I don't want to like download any games and then I don't want to like get anything or anything like that. Because I know that the um the the Minecraft Pocket Edition I'm getting that on my tablet, uh, just because that uh, it's got a bigger screen on it. So another thing I'm going to be using my uh, my new phone for um is I might do random videos on it. Um, I might do maybe funny stunts on it, maybe challenges I might do on it. Uh, also, I'm going to do um, vlogs on it as well, so I'll be doing like vlogs everywhere and stuff like that. So I definitely will be using it for vlogs because I did use my old phone for vlogs, so I will definitely be using uh, vlogs for it for this one. So next question is, by the way, is how long am I going to be having this one for? Well, to be honest with you, I want to try and have it for three years because at the moment, uh, my iPhone 7, I had that for nearly two years. So I want to try and have this one for... Um, Hopefully over three years, hopefully. So when we get to um, 2021, I think I might be moving to the new iPhone 12. It might be might end up 12 or something like that. So that'll probably be the new one. So I want to try and have this one for hopefully over three years. And I basically, when it's start to get old or something like that, I'll start uh, moving on to the iPhone um, 12, which will be exactly the, uh, the same phone as the other one, but it'll just be a little bit different. 
Uh, so yeah, that's kind of all the way how it works. So uh, what I'm going to go and do now is I'm going to go and head back into camera and I'm going to go show you the, the, um, the other way now. So the other way is a bit different. So you can see that, look at the camera distance between looking at a webcam and looking at the, uh, the camera. It looks quite cool, doesn't it? You can, yeah, you can kind of see me uh, in, the, uh, in, in the webcam there. You can, you can see me pointing my face on like that. So see by two screens, but... Um, yeah, uh, also this camera view looks pretty cool. You can see that this one is uh, is exactly the same as in 1K. So you can basically see uh, how it works in, uh, in the 1K version. And it's a little bit different. I thought it would have been in, uh, in 4K, but uh, they uh, they basically just did it in 1K. It's exactly the same as the, uh, the old one. And then if I just go into, uh, into photo, a uh, photo is uh, basically exactly the same. It is a little bit blurry in photo there. Uh, but the uh, photo is a little bit uh, of, uh, of exactly the same as, as what you compare from, uh, from the old film. But... Well, basically the focus on it is pretty much incredible like the focus is just unbelievable i can take some great photos on it as well and it's uh great videos it will be very very cool as well and i also like seeing my um see my face will be it'll be better as well compared to that one as well so and when you do actually end up seeing my, my face it'll be a little bit more better when you um compare um uh, to what uh, to, uh, to the one uh, that i had from before so um yeah, so you can see by, by the two views, it does look a little bit more better uh, compared to uh, to camera focus. And I think it looks uh, really, really cool. So I think it looks um, looks pretty good uh, compared to uh, on, on camera. And then also I've got my other apps. And also you can see the clock uh, is on the left-hand side this time. Uh, because basically the clock used to be in the in the middle, uh, but now the other clock's on the left-hand side. So uh, one thing um, I've noticed about, um, about, about the new phone as well is I basically noticed that now uh, I can actually uh, every time if I uh, if I maybe go on YouTube or something like that, um, basically the clock will actually stay on the top of the screen. Uh, or technically maybe if I get like messages from Facebook or something like that, uh, technically the the clock will stay on the left hand side. And uh, well, technically, uh, what I mean by that is I mean by uh, basically the clock will just stay where it is, so it won't fade away. Because um, I noticed that on it on my old phone when I when I used to go on YouTube and stuff. Uh, basically the clock used to not be there so i didn't even tell what the time was or something like that but now every single time when i go on youtube so i'm going to do an example now by the way so if i just go on youtube if i just go and just watch um if i just go and watch the video that i've just uploaded you can see that look at what the difference is compared to the one so you can see that the clock is actually still on the top screen and that, that is really cool and also basically the wi-fi is still there as well so yeah that is really really cool because that's basically one thing i am um, i do i do love about this new phone is because the focus on it is, is pretty incredible the clock is still exactly the same also like basically youtube is exactly the same so you can see that when i'm like scrolling through videos or something like that that is exactly the same i also like the um the other front home screen is exactly the same so i'm actually just going to show you work through that so that's just exactly the same when I'm scrolling through videos and something like that. Just it basically just exactly the, the same thing compared to the other ones. To be fair, uh, technically when uh, when you're looking, I know so like when you're looking at decent apps um, or something like that, it's, it's it's technically just exactly the same when you compare to um, to the um, yeah to the other one where it was just a little bit different. And um, I'm, I'm, I'm when I'm technically uh, opening stuff or or something like that. Also, I do get calculator, which is very, very good as well. So that's uh, that's pretty good. So I'll be able to use uh, a proper calculator as well. Because basically, every single time when I'm in um, when I'm in college, if I'm doing maths or something, uh, I'll be able to uh, get uh, I'll be able to get my calculator, and then I'll be able to like uh, maybe cheat in maths or something like that, which I don't want to do. But like, every time if I get like stuck on a question, I can just open my calculator, and then I'll be able to uh, see what the what the answer is going to it to be. Uh, the calculator is not too bad. Um, it's pretty much like a normal calculator, but like. Uh, basically, the way how they've done the calculator is a lot bit more different uh, from um, from normal calculators. So when you get a normal one, it's a little bit more different because that has more numbers uh, from the um, the uh, the old calculator. I think what I'm going to do then is I might as well go and show, uh, show off the calculator. Um, I know that I don't usually do it, uh, but yeah, this is uh, this is the calculator here. So it's basically just exactly the same uh, from the um, uh, from uh, from the old phone, but basically the um, the other one is a little bit more different because it's got a little bit more space uh, on that uh, on that as well. Um, and uh, yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool. I also uh, check in the, uh, the battery length as well. So if I just go in, so basically the way how I check the battery length is that is I've got to uh, go on the right hand corner. So if I just go um, like that, hang on, just try and do it. There we go. So you can see that the way how it works. So uh, you can see that there's my battery length there. And I know so we've got the uh, the O2 UK, which is actually my, my contract I'm on, on, the, uh, on this phone at the moment. I will be uh, staying on the O2 until my contract runs out in like a couple of years, until I, uh, until I get the other one. Because 
like the contract I was supposed to be going on was that was Vodafone, uh, but apparently um, uh, the the new phone wasn't uh, wasn't wasn't good on. Oh, just oh, bro, just I've I've actually just turned my uh, my my torch on. You know. Ah, come on, oh, shit. it's going wrong then. Right, it's not like it's not like me get back to it now. God's sake, what, what's this bloody thing doing there? I'll just get back to. Uh... There we go. Okay, right, right, we're back, we're back again. Yeah, so uh, basically, yeah, uh, I won't be staying on O2 for a while because I was supposed to be going on Vodafone, uh, but apparently I couldn't be able to to get on it because my phone wasn't wasn't part of that. So yeah, I had to stay on O2, but I don't mind O2. I th um, it is a little bit better than um than than EE because one thing I've noticed about O2, uh, I do get a lot more bars when I'm out and stuff like that. So um, yeah, it's a little bit more better. Um. So that's just pretty much all the stuff. So basically that button down there, what I've just pressed is my torch button. So basically if I should go and do a big view of my torch, uh, yeah, there you go. So you can see there's a big view of my torch. Like I'm, I'm, what I use my torch for is absolutely pretty simple. I just technically, um, I can actually turn it off now. I'll just go um, oh, back to normal strategies again. I need to go and just go and turn, there we go, just turn that off. So yeah, that's that's kind of the way how I do uh, like torch strategies or something like that. And also the, the clock is pretty simple um, as well. And then like like basically every, like opening every other app is really really cool as well. So that's it. That's really cool to be able to to use as well. And like like also like opening everything else. So like opening like weather for example as well. So um so yeah like technically when I like when I look at the weather forecast, but like basically the weather forecast is like really cool on this phone as well. So um yeah. That's really cool because uh, something I've not said by the way is I'm going to do another one tomorrow. I'm going to do uh, two videos of showing it off by the way because another when I did my uh, old phone I only did like one video of showing that off. So uh, I've been thinking that tomorrow's behind the scenes video um, is to show off um, of how it works. Um, I might go and maybe show off maybe some apps or something like that. Um, I might go and maybe do that tomorrow because tomorrow's one might be a little bit shorter just because I'm not going to really show everything off for tomorrow's one. So um yeah, that's probably going to be uh, tomorrow's one. But apart from that, guys, I'm 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 loving the phone at the moment. Um, it's it's pretty much exactly the same as my other one, but uh, basically a better screen. Um, so now I'm going to be talking about what what I do like about this phone. So what I do like about it is um, number one is the camera. The camera focus is better. Number two is the camera facing at me. It's got a lot more better camera view. Um, the screen is a lot more bigger. It's got a lot more protector on it. Uh, the apps are a bit better. Um, the brightness is a lot more better. Um, walking around with it is pretty pretty cool. Um, downloading situation is really good when I'm downloading apps or something like that. Um, putting the putting the clock on the front screen is good. Um, battery is pretty pretty good because the battery don't go down as too much. So yeah, that's that's all my opinions about it. I'm not going to go for all, uh, basically all my opinions because I do like technically like all them all anyway. So. Yeah, I just, I just basically just love the phone completely. So, so what do I think of it? Uh, I'm gonna give this phone. I'm, I'm gonna give it a ten out of ten. Um, just because that it's a good phone. Uh, I think my old phone was about seven, I think seven or six, something like that. But I got said that this one has got a little bit more power on it. I got said that, that that this one's got a lot more power. Um, and I think it's a lot more, uh, a little bit more better to control it compared to the the other one. So. Yeah, so that's what I've got to say um, about it. So I think that's everything that we need to talk about. Since this behind the scenes video has been on for quite a while, I think that is pretty much everything about it. Um, nothing else, but I think for, I think for the final time is I'm going to do the other click. There we go, like that. I think I think the final thing I've got to say about it is I've got to say it's just brilliant on on like contracts and voice system like that. Another another thing is as well is I'm glad that I've got all my um my messages back and all my phone numbers from all my friends as well so um yeah and that's uh that's uh, really cool and also growing a beard as well i need to i need to uh, shave this off at some point because there's been a lot of people um in my college uh, saying uh, why have you not uh, shaved your beard off yet and i've actually not done it yet i'll have to go and do it at some point next couple of weeks or something but um yeah a lot of people are not a lot of people have been out on about that but um yeah, so that is, uh, that, is, that is basically it for this behind the scenes video. Uh, basically, I will be uh, doing uh, another uh, behind the scenes video tomorrow, and that'll be the official final one uh, of the phone uh, before I do some more phones in the future. So, yep, so final time. What, uh, so basically, what we're going to be using my phone for, uh, I'm going to be using it for vlogs, random videos, uh, daft videos, challenges, um, maybe showing off stuff or something like that. Um, yeah, that's what, that's what I'm going to be using it for. 
and they're also doing collaborations on it as well with my friends as well um that should be a really good so yep so um what do i think of it really really good and uh, yeah hopefully you guys really like it as well so that was my behind the scenes video of showing off my new phone my iphone 10 x uh, plus x max so um <clears throat> Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the uh, behind the scenes video. And like I said, tomorrow there will be another one of uh, doing, uh, doing another one. Uh, that one probably will be a little bit shorter uh, because I'm not going to make that one too long. I'll just tell you guys some information about it. So, yep, so thanks for uh, basically behind the scenes videos on faces coming up very, very soon. Uh, and also there'll be pl uh, plenty more on it on Minecraft uh, stuff as well, uh, which will be coming up pr pretty soon. Uh, so the next one will be tomorrow and it'll be another fun one. So hopefully you guys uh, do, uh, do enjoy. So. Yep, so thank you, thank you for showing uh, uh, the, the, uh, this face behind this video of, of showing off my, my new phone. Uh, and uh, I will see you uh, tomorrow. Bye!